This your boy back at it. We have this GLS Outdoor green denim jacket. And so my goal is to bleach below that tape there then bleach the sleeves and I'm gonna dye them. And then bonus, we're gonna do a whole second jacket too, but this first one, so I had the bleach. It's already been wet and soaked, so the bleach is it in. Generally, this looks like kind of a cheap dye. You know, anything non-blue comes out pretty fast, so we're gonna go ahead and let's see what happens. Mention me. Thank you, Nyla, for holding the camera. You're welcome. And through this whole process. <laughs> It's already coming out. Yes, yeah, it's already coming. You can already see it coming out. Mm -hmm. You know what? We have this. Come on over here, Nyla. Let's look at this guest jet. Come on over here. Come over here to this one. This one, really, I just want to bleach the bottom part. Really, just this part, not really the part below it. So I'm just going to try to do that part down there. Tell how the tape is there. I try to minimize the bleach that's gonna be go above it. So, Ooh. but these jackets. Get up there. Guys, their jacket one? really, really well. So, this may not be enough to get it to come off. All right, let's see. Let's go back to this one. far so good kind of got like a weird banana coloring I'm gonna turn it over and make sure the back is done as well And when you wet it, you keep it wet because it helps the bleach soak in. You know, bleaching a dry jacket never, all you get is probably spots. You don't really get nothing effective. It's always more efficient when you soak whatever. And that goes for dye too. It should always be wet. So, okay. It's coming right out. And I'm holding it up because some of the bleach has probably already got on the, um, the bricks. And so I don't want to lay it down and lay it in there even though I have tape on it. So, in fact, Nyla, follow me. I'm gonna move it to about right here. Let's see, you can see that to this one. Like, no bleach is doing anything. Like, it's nothing, but, all right. So, let's go back to this one. I'm gonna let's see, let me cut on the water, I'm gonna rinse it all out. Hi guys! Look at that. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna rinse it and get it ready to die and we'll check in. Alright, so here, back at it. And this rit dye in the spray bottle. Um I use the whole bottle because I want because it's denim. A little bit of salt, a little bit of, uh, a little, about a spoonful of dishwashing liquid, a spoonful of vinegar and hot water. And so I'm going to start, like I said, doing the edges here. I think I'm going to add another color in between. Nyla, what do you think? Sure. Like in between the green up here and this space here, I, mean, I think I'm going to add not? another color. I'm just not for sure what color yet. So I adjust my sprayer. And same thing here. And these are just dollar store spray bottles. Nothing, nothing crazy. I mean, nothing expensive. Um, 
generally I get the dye from usually Joanne Fabrics or um, what's the name of the other craft store, Nyla? We go to Joanne Fabrics. What's the other one? I don't know. Yes, you do know. No, I don't. It'll come to me. But well, basically, RC Craft Store. Usually, I don't know, four, six bucks for this stuff, so it's usually not that much. Now, what do you think? Should I add a color in the middle? I have, I have like a strong yellow, and I have blue. What do you think, Mom? Whatever you want. So you don't have any. You are here to help, Dad. Nine one. <laughs> so what, what do you think? Like in the middle, or should I just do the orange? This is this is orange. It's probably gonna look more reddish, or should I not? I mean, what do you? Can you help, Dad? <laughs> any suggestions? I think red and yellow. Yellow in the middle. Okay, so use that yellow that's already kind of in there or add the, the new yellow? Add the new yellow. All right, for those, this is the new yellow. I'm out of the red yellow. So let's, let's see what happens. Very red. Yeah. Let's see what happens. Uh, not a big difference. Big enough. I can dig it. It's hard to see it on the camera. It is? Okay. Well, maybe we got to turn it over. So maybe we'll be able to see it more after it's all said and done. You're supposed to wear gloves doing this, but I, I, just, I don't. <laughs> You're supposed to though. You're always supposed to wear the uh, Hashtag daredevil. <laughs> How do you, what do you think, Anna? So far so good or what? I like it. You like it? Because I don't think you were feeling the colors at first. No, Get back a little bit. Okay, you see where we're going with it. We're gonna turn it around and do the back and we will check in with you when it's all said and done. Peace. Bye. All right, we're back at this guest jacket. Um, see, I bleached the bottom half. I didn't try to strip it over the top because um, I decided I really didn't want to do nothing like dye the whole half of the jacket. I bleached the whole half. I just kind of wanted to do the ends of it. And so, got that in. Some of this yep. in. And so, I'm going to start with a yellow and see if that take. It's green. No, it's, this is yellow. Well, it's yellow. It's green. It's, it's yellow. But it's turning green. Well, when, <laughs> thank you, Nyla. When it, when it all turns, we'll see what it looks like. Yeah, it does look a little greenish, but it's still yellow. It's very green. Well, no, it's not very green. It's a yellowish <laughs> green. Mostly green. Yeah, no, but it's... It's very green. <laughs> Don't you know when you put blue on yellow or yellow on blue, it turns green? Thank you, Nyla, for the um, tutorial green. and coloring. Green, green. Let me see, I'm gonna turn it over. <laughs> and do this side. Uh huh, and that's also green. Right there. Get that greeny color. You are funny. <laughs> it is yellow. It's also green. Well, when it's all said and done, we'll let everybody decide. That it's green. All right. That seems pretty yellow. What do y'all think so far? Y'all please feel free to comment. I want y'all to think of how this is coming out. They're nodding their heads. 
They like it. They're nodding their heads. They like it. <laughs> it's funny. I think I'm going to add the orange on top of this one. They think that's a bad decision. Why is that? Why, why do you think it's a bad decision, guys? Why do they... Like, do you think it's a bad decision? Um, uh, I don't know. I just, I don't know. Green and orange? Hmm. Yep, green and orange. Green, orange, and yellow. I guess it's okay. They're not in your head, okay. Okay, here is the orange. Well, you know what? Maybe I should just leave it like that. What you think, Nyla? Your decision. Okay. Zoom in. You know what? I'll think about it and we'll check back. Can you add some music to this? <laughs> hey, stop. Man. What up? Back at it with the finished result. Um, I'm digging it. This is not a shirt I probably wear. Where I just kind of had this on already and just threw it on, but that's cool. We got. It came out kind of a, I don't know, like a orange tomato reddish. That's cool. The yellow kind of amped up. The yellow had already faded too from the original color. And then the original green right here. You can check out the back. It's not very even. It's not very even? No, not really. Well, that's okay. If you look at this side, it's down here. Mm -hmm. And then turn around. And then on this side, it's all the way up here. Oh, that's okay. That's okay. Yeah, I mean, it, it, the goal is not necessarily to get it perfect, but to make it different and, and, and kind of artsy and fly at the same time. So I feel very fly right now, and this is fly. And that is it. So uh, check back in with another jacket. Beep. All right, this is the final outcome of the, this is the guest one. Yeah, this is the guest jacket. I'm good with it because I didn't want to do nothing, nothing over the top. The main thing was kind of trim the bottom, the bottom edges of it. And it's dyed a bleach dyed in well, so it did. But that was the main thing that I said, the bleach these down and then added the yellow and that kind of made it like a weird yellowish, bluish color type thing. And then I ended up um, just kind of sporadically spraying red over it. And so if you get real close, you can kind of see the hint of um, like orange and a reddish tone to it. But it's not over the top, it's there, but it's not there. So, um. I'm good with it. Y'all can tell me what y'all think, but I think this is a good one. All right, y'all. Wait. Peace. Wait, what? Look at the green goodness. <laughs> I told you people it was green, and looky here. It's green. Okay. Thank you. Like and subscribe. Bye. <laughs>